Hi everyone, it's Kay here and welcome to this new video. Uh, today I'm going to show you if you just downloaded Audacity and using a Mac computer, you may be having trouble uh, figuring out how to connect your microphone. So I'm going to show you how you can connect your microphone and make it workable. You can see here, if I try to select my microphone, I can't find it, even though for now I don't have it connected to the computer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and connect my microphone the Yeti stereo microphone to this computer and then I'll make sure that I can show you guys how you can get it over here to be able to show so you can use it to record whatever you're recording in Audacity. You can see if I go up here and check on the uh, audio status you can see I have sound floors and then I also have inter internal uh, the internal gadget but I don't have my microphone showing up here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and connect the microphone right now. And then after connecting my microphone to the computer, I'll go ahead and show you, walk you through the settings that you're supposed to be using in order for you to be able to record uh, the audio using your microphone. But if you just plug the microphone, even if it's a quality USB microphone like mine right now, you won't be able to see it. So now that I've plugged my microphone, you can see it here the Yeti stereo microphone but the problem is when you come over here to audacity you won't be able to see it so we're going to go ahead and go to the settings and then in the settings i'm going to show you how to configure it okay so in the settings you want to go here to the audio and here uh you still see you can't see it here so what we're going to do we're going to go to this uh to these audio settings here and you can see you have input output and this other option here which we don't need we're going to go to input so in the input section is where you want to select your microphone we're going to go ahead and select the yeti stereo microphone and make sure that whenever we input the audio which we're going to be recording with the audacity it will be able to show up you can adjust the volume here for the microphone and I'm going to go ahead and close this and then I'm going to go ahead and open it again to show you that I selected the Yeti stereo microphone. You can see it here in the input. It's selected. Now it's not showing up here yet. So what you want to do, you want to close this, but now pay careful attention to this. If you just close it and then reopen it like this, it's not going to show up. It is not going to show up and I know you all are going to send me uh, messages asking why it's not showing up. The problem is you did not close Audacity right. If you're using a Mac computer, you want to go ahead and close this open program of Audacity first. And then after closing Audacity here, you have to go up in the toolbar and then say quit audacity and if you quit audacity from there it will be able the next time you that's where you go and say quit audacity and next time when you go to your launcher and open up audacity you have to open it up fresh and it brings this emblem that shows audacity and then it brings up all these dialogues first the best thing would be to restart your computer, but we're not going to do that. So we're going to go ahead now and I'll show you the Yeti stereo microphone is showing and you can select it. And voila, you can go ahead and record whatever you want now and be able to edit and use your audio any way you want it. And now I'm trying to record a test record right now. Uh, my microphone is muted anyways. But guys, thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you again in the next video please go ahead and subscribe and also share and gives us a thumb uh, give us a thumbs up bye for now